social media be protected under free speech? Um, I don't know. I think that social media should... So, like, whenever you say free speech... I think free speech... There's, like, different types of free speech that I think are, like, sometimes more and less important than others. So, for example, um... I think somebody's free speech of being able to distribute somebody's personal information is not acceptable, but somebody's free speech to express a political opinion should be acceptable. And um, uh, let me think of other examples. Like, uh, I think targeted harassment and things like that. Like, I guess the way that I look at it is that what is the real world equivalent to a certain type of behavior and then I kind of translate it over to the to the internet and I think like what would what would be the equivalent to this so I think like the internet equivalent to stalking should be bannable like a hundred percent but you know like extreme political opinions I, I don't really think should be banned I think the only time that extreme political opinions should be banned is whenever they call for violence against people or like implied violence against people. Leaking information can be considered illegal if intent is harassment. Yeah, but it should just be considered illegal, period. The thing is like, it, it, that I think that's another instance of just other stupid, I don't, I don't know. Have you ever been stalked? I mean, like, not really. Like, I mean, I've had people that will, like, fuck with me and try to stalk me and stuff, but, like, not... I mean, the thing is, like, I know people that have actually been stalked, and, like, no, I've not had anything remotely close to that. Separate the mobs. Just burn them down. Twitch is private own. There are no public spaces left. People need to... Need non-commercial public spaces to voice opinions. Yeah, I mean, I, I think that, uh, I don't have the answer for that, like, how social media should be regulated. Because in a way, I'd want it to be regulated, but how can I trust a government any more than I could trust Twitter? You know what I mean? Like, it sounds like a good idea, oh, the government's gonna regulate Twitter. But people always say that in the context of them, oh, the government can always regulate Twitter the way that I want them to regulate Twitter. What happens whenever they don't? That's the problem. Uh, you need to switch ads. That's why you need to switch ads. Uh, kill the tank and then res him. Uh, kill the tank and then, then res him. Oh, okay. Alright, just separate him after this. Yeah, so like Tyrannus just taunt the other one and, you know, take him back and forth. All right, nice. Private loan, it won't need regulation. I don't know, I think that, uh, you know, you can look at a lot of social media websites and... I don't know, like, it's... The online, like, atmosphere and everything, I think changed a lot of, like, the way that people, like, kind of have power and, you know, like, what a monopoly is and everything like that. I don't think Jack knew what Twitter would become. He doesn't want to deal with it. I think Jack from Twitter probably has like a... I don't think he's like this, you know, terrible person. I, I, I kind of agree with you. I think he just doesn't know what the fuck's going on. Because he has people from like both sides of, you know, every issue trying to like trying to co-opt his platform to like push their agenda. And then they want to have, like, special privileges to push that agenda. Uh, it's just really, uh... It's a really bad situation for him to be in.